Josh yet. First full 90 minutes in the league and a win as well. Just let us know how you're feeling. Oh, obviously over, over the moon, especially that we've got the three points. It's, it's, that's, the, that's, the, that's what we came here for. We came here to get the three points. Gaffer was saying in change rooms, we need to be better away. But, so we've got the three points and it's obviously over the moon to make my full debut. You've obviously already made an appearance for Blues in the League Cup, but this is certainly a, di a different kettle of fish, isn't it, in the league? Yeah, league, league football is a lot tougher. It's a lot more hard work and stuff. And I felt the lads and that we dug in really well to get the win today. Well, it was a, a baptism, baptism of fire for you because you were certainly made to defend, certainly in the first half and at the end as well. Yeah, obviously, that's what, that's what you have to be put through in 23s. You need to learn this side of the game because if you get put in, then you need to be able to deal with it. And that's what the manager wants. So, yeah, I felt I've been... Been um, trained well to deal with it, and I think I can do it. Brentford obviously have a lot of possession, it's something I'm sure you would expect, but Blues seem to deal with that and look a real threat themselves going forward, didn't they, on the counter? Yeah, the, the gaffer said before, it's like they said they're going to play, they're going to try and play, and we need to be narrow and stuff, and we need to work hard off the ball. And I think the lads did that today. There was times in the game in the first half where we dropped off it a bit, but then in the second half, I think we went out and we did, this, did the job. Because Blues did, as you mentioned there, looked a lot more comfortable in the second half and got the second goal. But we then disappointed that Brentford managed to get one back because that came at a time where they didn't look like they, look, they were looking a goal threat. Yeah, I know. We, we, did, we didn't want the goal, obviously, but that's football. Sometimes you have to, you, you can see one, you need to just dig in and get the result. But I thought they did it. Excellent. Did you feel personally that you sort of grew into the game because sort of towards the end of it, you were at the far post having to do some, some real last-ditch defending with a, a predator like Scott Hogan lurking a lot of the time? Yeah, it's just you, you've got to be ready at all times of the game because it can happen at any time. So to do it in the last minute, that's what you, that's what you train for. That's what you've got to be able to do if you want to be in the first team. So, yeah, I've done that well. Rhys Brown then came on in directly in front of you at right midfield. It must be nice for yeah. you to, to see sort of a fellow youngster coming through like yourself. Yeah, obviously it's amazing that me and Brownie were able to get on the pitch together because we've been playing through 23s and 18s and 16s. So, yeah, it's, it's a real achievement. I'm sure for you now it's just more of the same. I'm sure you'll be desperate to retain your place for Barnsley next week. Yeah, obviously you've got to keep on working hard in training and stuff. Like Just because I made my debut, I don't mean I come off the hard work. I've still got to work hard and just got to keep on going in training and stuff, show the gaffer I can fit in again.